health of cells. Today we shall be learning about mitosis, the process of cell division. There are six steps to the process of mitosis. The first step is... Sorry to interrupt you from your boring TV program, but we have a better one. This is the Jeff McCoy Experience. cell division occurs. There are six stages of mitosis. The first stage is interphase. During the interphase, chromosomes duplicate and proteins are made. Interphase is referred to as the resting period, but this is untrue because interphase is one of the most active parts of mitosis. And the surprising thing is we actually met somebody whose name is interphase, and we now go out to Eric Benson who is interviewing this person. Microphone. So, I hear interphase is the longest step of the cell cycle. Could you tell us about your childhood? It was long, very long. Anything else you can tell us? Nah. Isn't interphase also when the chromosomes in the cell duplicate? Chromosomes! Chromosomes are the work of the devil! The devil, I tell you! Thank you, Eric, for that lovely report. Now, the second stage of mitosis is prophase. During prophase, the nucleus starts to disappear, chromosomes start to become visible, and spindle fibers start to form. This is an example of prophase. The third stage of mitosis is metaphase. During metaphase, chromosomes line up in the middle of the cell and the spindle fibers are fully formed. Then the spindle fibers attach themselves to the chromosomes. This, an example of metaphase could be birds lining up during flight. The fourth part of mitosis is anaphase. During the anaphase, chromosomes split apart and go to the end of the cell. Example of this would be SECURITY <laughs> The fifth part of mitosis is telophase. During telophase, the chromosomes are now at the end of the cell and the spindle fibers have disappeared. Also, the cell has begun to squeeze in and getting ready to split apart. Sixth and last and final step of mitosis is cytokinesis. During cytokinesis, the cell forms two new daughter cells and two new membranes. Then they split apart and they start all over again at interphase. An example of this would be two Siamese twins getting cut up by a doctor. Sorry folks, but we're in the last minute of the Jeff McQuay experience. So, now it is time to listen to some fan mail. Jacob Reimer asks, How does the gravitational pull of a black hole affect the formation of a star? Mike? I am sorry, Jacob Reimer, but we do not know the answer to this complex question. Our intelligence does not meet your matters. So now we are on to question number two of our fan mail. When we should ask, Can you get Sivvy to say drop? Sivvy, could you come say drop for us? Drop. Thanks for joining us for the Jeff McQuay experience. Bye, folks.